Ever wonder why some people seem to navigate through life effortlessly, while others struggle? Could it be that they've mastered the art of communication? Take a moment and think about it. Communication is the lifeblood of our interactions. Whether we're negotiating a business deal, trying to impress a date, or simply chatting with friends. It is a complex dance of verbal and nonverbal cues that can make or break our relationships and endeavors. Imagine you're in a business meeting. You have a great idea, but if you cannot articulate it effectively, it's like having a gold mine but lacking the tools to extract the gold. Good communication skills are those tools. They allow you to express your thoughts clearly, persuasively, and with conviction, making others not only understand, but also buy into your vision. Let's shift the scenario to something more personal. You're on a date and you're nervous. You might be the most charming person in the room, but if your body language screams discomfort, your date is likely to pick up on that. Nonverbal communication, like eye contact, facial expressions, and posture can speak volumes about your confidence and interest level. Mastering these cues can make your interactions more meaningful and enjoyable. Now, picture a typical day in your life. You interact with a variety of people, family, friends, colleagues, strangers. Each interaction requires a degree of communication. Effective communication can turn these everyday interactions into opportunities, opportunities to learn, to influence, to build relationships, and to succeed. In essence, communication is a key that unlocks doors in business, relationships, and life in general. It's not just about talking or gesturing. It's about conveying your thoughts, emotions, and intentions in a way that resonates with others. It's about listening and understanding as much as it is about speaking and expressing. Mastering communication skills isn't a luxury, but a necessity for anyone striving for success in any aspect of life. So let's embark on this journey to become better communicators and in turn lead better lives. Now, what exactly makes good communication? Is it about talking more or listening more? Well, communication at its core is a two-way street. It's not just about how much you talk, but also about how well you listen. The best communicators are those who manage to strike a balance between the two. They understand that communication isn't a monologue, but a dialogue. It's a dance between speaking your mind and understanding the thoughts of others. And speaking of understanding, it plays a crucial role in good communication. It's not enough to hear the words that someone is saying. You need to comprehend their meaning, their context, their underlying emotions. This is where empathy comes into play. Empathy allows you to put yourself in the other person's shoes, to understand their perspective, their feelings, their motivations. It helps you connect with them on a deeper level, making your communication more effective and meaningful. But communication isn't just about words. In fact, a large chunk of our communication is nonverbal. This includes our facial expressions, our body language, our tone of voice. These nonverbal cues can often speak louder than words. They can convey emotions, attitudes, and intentions that words might fail to express. They can reinforce what we're saying or, in some cases, contradict it. For example, you could be saying something positive, but if your tone is harsh, your body language closed off, your facial expression grim, your message might not come across as intended. On the other hand, a warm tone, open body language, and a friendly smile can enhance even the simplest of messages. That's why good communicators pay attention to their nonverbal cues. They ensure that their words and their actions are in sync, that their message is clear and consistent, both verbally and nonverbally. So you see, good communication is a blend of talking, listening, understanding, empathy, and nonverbal cues. It's about creating a connection, a mutual understanding, a shared meaning. Great communicators are not just good talkers, but also excellent listeners who understand the power of empathy and nonverbal cues. So, how can you enhance your verbal communication skills? Well, my friend, it's simpler than you might think. Let's dive into some clear, manageable steps that will have you communicating better in no time. Firstly, clarity is key. Your audience, whether it's one person or a room full of people, needs to understand what you're saying. Avoid jargon and complex language that might confuse your listener. Instead, opt for simple, straightforward language. When you speak clearly, you ensure your message gets across exactly as you intended. Next, brevity is your best friend. Remember, less is more. 
It's easy to fall into the trap of over-explaining or rambling, but this can lead to your audience losing interest. Instead, try to keep your messages concise and to the point. This doesn't mean you should rush, but rather, you must select your words carefully and prioritize your key points. Relevance is another crucial factor. Make sure your message aligns with your audience's interests and needs. If you're speaking about something they care about, they're more likely to listen and engage. So do your homework. Understand your audience and tailor your message to them. Now let's talk about practicing public speaking. The more you do it, the better you'll get. Join a local speaking club, take a public speaking course, or practice in front of friends or family. Public speaking is a skill, and like any skill, it can be improved with practice. Finally, don't forget about active listening. Good communication isn't just about talking, it's also about listening. When you actively listen, you show the speaker that you value their thoughts and opinions. This not only encourages them to communicate more openly with you, but it also provides you with valuable insights that can help you communicate more effectively. Improving verbal communication is a journey that starts with understanding the basics of effective speaking and listening. It may take some time and effort, but the results are well worth it. So why not start your journey today? But what about nonverbal communication? How can you get better at that? Nonverbal communication is an umbrella term covering everything from body language, facial expressions, to the tone of voice. It's that secret language we're all speaking, even when we're silent, and it's potent, sometimes even more so than words. So how can you improve it? Firstly, let's talk about body language. It's said that our bodies speak volumes before our mouths even open. To become a better nonverbal communicator, you need to become aware of your posture. Stand tall, make sure your shoulders are relaxed and your hands are visible when you speak. This shows that you're open, confident, and trustworthy. Next up, facial expressions. They're the window to our emotions and they can make or break a conversation. A genuine smile can create a warm and inviting atmosphere, while a frown can introduce tension. So pay attention to what your face is saying. If you're feeling good, let your face show it. If you're not, try to maintain a neutral expression. Then there's the tone of voice. It's not just about what you say, but how you say it. A calm and steady voice conveys confidence and trustworthiness. On the other hand, a high-pitched, fast-paced voice can make you seem anxious or nervous. So practice speaking slowly and clearly. But how can you become more aware of these nonverbal cues? The answer is mindfulness and self-awareness. Spend some time each day observing how you react in different situations. Do you cross your arms when you're nervous? Do you raise your voice when you're excited? The more you understand about your nonverbal cues, the better you can control them. Also, don't forget to observe others. Notice how their body language, facial expressions, and tone of voice change depending on the situation. This will not only help you understand them better, but will also give you a benchmark to compare your nonverbal communication skills. Nonverbal communication is just as important as verbal communication, and improving it requires mindfulness and self awareness. By investing some time into understanding and improving your nonverbal communication, you'll become a more effective and empathetic communicator. So, what can you expect when you start to communicate more effectively? Well, let's delve into it, shall we? When you fine-tune your communication skills, the world opens up in new and exciting ways. Let's start with business. In a world where every word counts, improved communication can be the difference between landing that big deal or walking away empty-handed. It can help you to clearly convey your ideas, making you more persuasive and influential. It allows you to build trust with colleagues and clients, which is the cornerstone of any successful business relationship. Now let's talk about dating. Improved communication can be the secret sauce to a flourishing love life. It can help you express your feelings and desires more openly, leading to stronger connections and deeper intimacy. It can also aid in resolving conflicts in a healthy way, fostering a more harmonious relationship. In the broader scope of relationships, whether it's with friends, family, or colleagues, better communication is a powerful tool. It can help you understand and be understood, fostering deeper connections and promoting empathy. It's about more than just talking. It's about listening, understanding, and responding in a way that demonstrates respect and care for the other person. And when it comes to life in general, the impact of improved communication is profound. 
It can help you navigate complex situations with grace, express your thoughts and feelings with confidence, and build strong relationships based on mutual understanding and respect. Communication, in its essence, is about connecting with people. It's about sharing our thoughts, ideas, and feelings, and understanding those of others. When we communicate effectively, we build bridges of understanding that can lead to stronger, more fulfilling relationships in every aspect of life. So whether it's in the boardroom, on a date, or just chatting with a friend, remember the power of good communication. It's a skill worth mastering, for it can truly transform your life. Improving your communication skills can be a game changer, opening doors to understanding, stronger relationships, and success in every aspect of life.